Hello, it's Lucy here from Radio.co. In this video, we're looking at how to broadcast your radio station using Audio Hijack. Thanks for checking out Radio.co on YouTube. If you want to see more kit reviews, live webinars and handy broadcasting tips, then give us a thumbs up, hit subscribe and click the bell icon. Firstly, Audio Hijack is a simple digital audio workspace for Mac. It's designed to broadcast all audio on Mac and it can record it at the same time. So as long as your audio source is connected to your Mac or it's playing through it, you can broadcast it using Audio Hijack. This means you can have control over several audio sources, which is perfect for radio shows. Audio Hijack is now in its fourth edition and this version has loads of new features, including more ways to alter your audio, some improvements to the interface and the ability to keep it running in the background. And that's just to name a few. So get started by creating a new session in Audio Hijack and then choose Blank Session Template. Rename your session template something meaningful like your radio station name. And now, as a rule of thumb, you can broadcast your equipment like mixers, microphones, sound cards by using the input device block. And for software like Spotify or iTunes or Skype or Zoom, you can use the application block. And now drag in the broadcast block. Click this block and under setup, complete the details. If you use radio.co, you'll need to select Shoutcast V1 and copy your host, port and pass right from the radio.co dashboard under the live tab. When you're ready to broadcast to your station, just hit run. After a few moments, you'll be broadcasting the audio from your Mac right to your radio station. But that's not all you can do though. You can make audio adjustments to improve audio quality, reduced post-production, or just for creative control. So under the built-in effects, you'll find loads of blocks to do this, like the new Magic Compressor block. This will boost quiet sounds, but keep loud sounds the same. Or you could use the 10-band EQ filter block to tweak audio levels before they go out. To use a block to adjust your audio, just place it in between your input and your output blocks and then adjust the settings if needed. If you don't want to bother with all the different blocks and you just want to broadcast all the audio that's playing on your Mac, select the system audio block, drag this in and it will take everything and broadcast it out to your radio station. And just before you go, how would you like to launch your very own online radio station? Surprisingly, it's a lot simpler than you may think. And the absolute best way to get started is by chatting to myself or another member of the Radio.co team. To do that, just head to radio.co forward slash demo to schedule a video call with us, where we'll discuss your plans, answer your questions, and of course, guide you around the Radio.co software.